first thing in the morning. Look in the mirror, say, bitch, I'm the best. Look. No matter why I try, 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 you can never be me, never I, I, I. Hi, guys, welcome back. So, Love Me Here sent me this wig, and I'm going to show you guys how I slay it, how beautiful it is. They also sent me a few goodies in the box. And this is the wig so it comes with a nice thick elastic band for security and so the closure lays flat and then it also has a few clips on the inside for some added protection so your wig doesn't go anywhere this is a i think a two by six closure it's not a regular four by four so it's very small a very minimal parting space but it goes all the way back so it just makes a really nice middle part so the first thing I did was bleach my knots because they don't come bleached and then I went ahead and plucked it even though the hairline is pre-plucked. I just wanted to make it a little bit thinner so it looks more natural. I didn't do too much and I didn't add any baby hairs because the closure is so small and the lace itself doesn't really need it. Like it's very thin lace and it matched my skin tone perfectly. I didn't need to tint it or anything so it didn't need any baby hairs. This part is pretty much self-explanatory so I'm just going to allow you guys to watch and enjoy the music. Damn, Aiden, you a killer. Let's make this jewel. For the install, I didn't really need to do much. I just went ahead and cut my lace. And I used my hot comb again because my hair wasn't very flat underneath the wig. My braids were a little bit bulky, so I had to use my hot comb and just really try to press it out. I should have went in with my curling wand because that would have given it an even flatter press. But I didn't think of it until just now. So I just used my hot comb and I think it turned out pretty well. I did use a bit of got to be spray to stick down the edges of the lace but it really didn't need it honestly i was just being extra
one thing i liked about this wig aside from the color was that it came pretty much pre-cut like all i had to do was straighten it and slightly bump the ends to get that nice trendy natural long bob look i don't know what it's called but you guys know what i'm talking about the long bob bumped ends it was really really cute and i love the fact that i didn't need to trim the ends or anything love me here did a great job at prepping this wig so that it's really easy for you to just do a little prep and put it on and be cute Again, the link is in the description box for all the info to the wig. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Let me know your thoughts on it. And if you haven't already, please go ahead and click subscribe and check out another video on my channel if you're interested. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.